Hey guys, Pokedan here. In this video, I'll be showing you through my Pokemon. So I brought one of these Pokemon X and Y, Xerneas and Zekrom. So I'll be showing you cards I've got. I've already opened it because it was way too tempting. I don't know what this is for though. It's like sliding on and off, but it's just like a storage case, but the cards don't fit in it. So, start off, yeah, let's get started, I got, I don't know how to tell if the regular rares or not, but I got a Gumi, which is a, what is it, a dragon, which is a dragon, I got Lit Leo, something like that. Which is really cool because it's like a little clay model, like a real ground. It's really cool. Then I got Sandtrap. I like the art on these cards, X and Y. Got Metal Pad. Got Back Turn to you. I got Lily Pot, which is so cute. Tackle and Bite. Got Ekins. Don't know how to tell you if the regular rare or not, so please leave me in the comment section below if you know. I got Doduo. I got Slugma. Bleh. Bleh. Which evolves into. Oh, I forgot. I got. Rose, Rosarade, which is the pre-evolution of Rosalina, I think, something like that. I got Hello, Helioptile, which is an electric, just like, boo. Esther, which is quite creepy. This is a real ground thing as well. I got... Wellipede, which is the pre evolution, uh, uh, evolution of what's his name again? Wellipede, Venipede, that's it. And then energies, I only got fire energy. Uh, trainer cards, I got Ashana, I got Pokemon Center Lady, I got Fairy Garden. Now I'm taking you through my hollows. I got Dusk Moya. This is hollow, see? Hollow. I got. I forgot if this is a hollow or a. Uh, no, I think it's just a hollow. And I like the pattern on the card as well. It's Piney Co the pattern it's really cool then I got Mr. Mime which is not my favourite Pokemon it's a bit creepy finally I got Slurpuff so now I'm going to show you how to know if the Pokemon cards are fake so let's get into it to start off it's the back so look at the red there. It's like really a like, not dull but it's a bit dull red. That's on all of them. Then secondly, it's the see how much on the back the blue line stands out from here. If it's fake, this blue thing, the darkest blue in the corner, usually blends into it, but on a normal Pokemon card, it don't. So next is the picture, so just the picture. The picture don't look right or anything. Secondly, what number I am? I don't, I don't know. And then uh, it's the, if it's pre-evolution, look how clear my pre-evolution is. Well, it's not very clear because of my camera, 
but I can see it perfectly but usually it's really blurry and then it's the moves so the moves uh, if the moves are wrong the name is obvious so if it's got a wrong name then it's you know, type in just all stuff like that and then I'm going to show you if you buy the packs and then you see the actual boost pack and uh, if it's fake so yeah so the boost packs have got re really good art but I'm going to have to show you on this one because my other one's just ripped to pieces because I was so excited to open these so yeah so look at the art on that it's so good X and Y flash fire so yeah uh, so first and mainly it's the writing up here see how clear that is if you, it's a fake pack, then it would be, uh, it would be, I don't know what to say, speak now. If it was a fake pack, it would be like double, but it, it's all clear. If it was a fake pack, it would be pre -print, uh, double print printed. Also, this is after you've opened it, so you already must have made the mistake. Do you know when you open this bit? Because Pokemon want you to get into the cards. It's obviously this bit folds out and this bit just pulls off because they don't use very gl good glue. But if it's really hard to pull off and you're really struggling, then it's might not be fake, but it should be. So, yeah, they was the reasons and the cards. How to tell Pokemon cards are fake. So none of the cards were fake that I got in... Yeah, those are real. So this I definitely recommend it. But it's mainly the tin you buy in, not the actual cards. So yeah. Uh I think that's it for this video. Comment more videos you want me to do in. Subscribe. Leave a like and yeah. See you guys in the next video. Bye one second. My outro is usually on the keyboard and I do that. But I've just got my xylophone running. So do you want the outro to be more... Or... Which one do you like better? For this I'm just going to do both for the xylophone. Leave in the comment section which outro you want. That. That. Or both. So yeah.